What's up, everybody? How's it going? Let me make sure my mic is working. Oh, it might be turned up a little bit because of the uh, gaming stream. Okay, there we go. Whew, turned down a little bit. What's going on? Golden Majestic, Nubs, Hunts, Treasure, Robert, Mims, Gina R, Jonathan Reese, Byron the Collector, Linda Wallace is up in the house. Let's see, who else did I miss earlier? Jeremy Albritton's in here. Peggy Smiths. DA Sales, how's it going? Uh, let's see, Carl's Coins is up in the house. Who else, who else, who else? TJ Hunt stuff was here earlier. Mr. Marmello, thank you for the super chats. He says, cheers, boom. Yeah, please read out my Goanna statement loud when you first get live on the channel on the chat. All right, let's go see if this other one. Toasty Goanna fresh from the gum tree for everyone except Rob, he finds silver. I don't know what that means, but we got it. Here we go. What's up, Nubs? What's up, Kittle? Timothy Morell, how's it going? Oh, man. DA sales up in the house. What's going on, brother? All right, let's see. We are only doing one box tonight. New background, eh? Yeah, so this is uh, this is the wall. I actually used to sit. I used to sit right here, and the computer was right there on the wall and facing this direction, so like the room is behind me now. So it's a little bit, little bit different now. Uh, it kind of it helps with the lighting, so like behind me is not just a big dark background. So uh, and then like I have my bookshelf over here with the coins, some of the art that some people have sent me in. I guess you can't see the one up on the top where it says OG22. There we go. Let's see. Let me put that there. There we go. There's a little bit, but yeah. So uh, just some of the stuff some people have sent me. I wanted to throw it in there. And on you can see some of the pictures. Uh, this one, or this is the John Deere sign. This one, this one, and this one are three photos that uh, Jan Lewis sent in. So that's uh, those those right there on the wall. What's he giving away? He's giving away brass, dude. I've been asking for so long to get one of those uh, two shooters brass rounds. Come on. What's up, Joe Nelson, DC? How's it going? Good to see you. All right. Good to see everybody. Holy moly! Holy moly! We got 18 in here. I know it's going to be a raid right after. I already told Kittle, I was like, hey, could you please go and get the link and maybe throw it in there? I wasn't very nice, but you know. What's up, Robert Saves History? How's it going? Hey, Desert Rat Stacker. Uh, have we seen Nate Barber yet? He is the first one, and I don't know what he wants for his, uh, his 90s. What's up, Coyote Whacker? Bradley Schultz says, raid time. What's going on? Jimmy Lakari up in the house. Gringo. Oh man, who else? Silver Leaf, bring it on. What's going on, Apple user? What do you have for rolls? I am sold out, Josh. I'm only doing one box tonight. I am sold out. I don't have the appropriate amount of silver to do more than one box, so uh, so I'm kind of just stuck with one box for right now. So I was gonna put together auction stuff, but I really don't have a lot of stuff I want to get rid of. So that's uh, where we're sitting on that. Robert Saves History said, I wish I would have run that red seal on brass. Yeah, I wish I could just get one of those brass rounds, but, you know, I'll just have to make my own, I guess. New lines in the house. What's up, new line? Oh, uh, let's see. Uh, Ty Hitman, what's going on? What's going on? All right, let's see. Chris Knob, how's it going? Let me unplug that speaker and turn that one off. So there we go. So that way I can hear the commands when they come through. All right, so I'm going to close PayPal. My computer's being a little bit slow today. Um, I don't know why, but probably because of the new games I downloaded. But what's up, Modog Silver? How's it going? Good to see you. Zarek Farm up in the house. Congratulations on your new uh, goat being born today. That was really, really cool. Danny Seeley, how's it going? Juan Velasquez in the house. Roy M up in the house. <laughs> Nubs, cough, cough. I got rolls left for tomorrow. Nubs doesn't. He's actually got bank wrap rolls, which is funny. I had somebody email me today and say, uh, do you have bank wrap rolls or your own rolls? And they were like, I said, my own rolls tonight. And, oh, well, I don't want that. I want bank wrap. Well, sorry. Sorry. Uh, Robert Saves History. I'm in the same house. I just flipped myself around. So I used to sit back there. That's it. I used to sit back there and facing that direction. So here, let me show the uh, the baby goats that Zarek had born. There we go, I'll take your name off of it. There we go, all right, let's see. So we got this one right here, right there. Those are Zarek Farms new goats today. New goats. 
What's up, Carl's Coins up in the house. TJ Hunt stuff in here. What's up, Richard Sappington? And there's that one right there. Thank you, Mike Doyle. And the other one is Steal Something. Thank Steel Wheels, thank you for subscribing as well. That is awesome. Popcorn King up in the house saying, OG22, oh, what's up, Popcorn King? Metal Dragon Braveheart hunted some quarters today. Found 2002 Ohio. Looks really cool. Astronaut shows on both sides. Huh. Like a strike through, because that'd be kind of cool. Or a, a die clash. Not a strike through it. Die crash would be die clash would be pretty cool. Oh, let's see. Who else? G dubs in the house. What's going on? Looks like a raid party for for RFT, I know. Everybody smash the like on the way in. That would be awesome. Element 47, how's it going? Dick Lacrosse back in the chat. What's going on? Chris Southern Metal, how's it going? Brickitect fan. Robert Shirley. Do I sell stickers? Uh, I do, if you want to. You can send me an email for it. Thank you, JP Gamer. I do appreciate it. Hey, what's up, Jan Lewitt? Good to see you. Cavity Whacker still in here. Hit the way in. Hit the like on the way in. Uh, do, do, do. Let's see. I think I, Party Pickle, what's up? Uh, what's going on? Scarf Vaguely. Uh, who else? Ohio Coin Collector up in the house. What's going on? Element 47, my name is Victoria Winters. All right, cool. Uh, let's see. Call me Al, how's it going? Good to see you as well. Uh, Peggy, I'm already sold out for tonight. I am sold out for tonight. Oh wait, no, I'm watching Dark Shadows. I don't know what you mean. <laughs> oh, let's see, holy cow. Mr. Marmello, awesome back brass ground. Oh, awesome brass ground. Nice. Thank you, Mr. Marmello, for the super chat. That is awesome. TJ Hunt stuff. Hopefully my envelope made it to you. I uh, Let me check. <laughs> TJ, it did. It did. So that will be there on Saturday's mail call. It will be on there. So very, very cool. Thank you for that. All right, let's see. Let's get in here. Is Nate Barber up in the house yet? Let's see if he's taggable. Nate, he is not taggable. So, you know what? Where we will have... I will have Nubs. Nubs. We'll, uh, we'll pick the 90s. All right, let's see. Let's see. All right, here we go. And we have a... Did you get my big package, JW? I think you did. Uh, nubs, I don't. I don't have a package from you. I don't. You have to uh, email me about it. If it was something that I bought or something, then I I probably already opened it. Is that a giant OG22 carving on the wall? Yes, it is. That is from Angie Cat. Angie Cat made that. Handmade everything. Benji and Roll22. Okay, let's see. So, let's see. There we go. We'll type that in there. The 10 ounce package. Did you send me a 10 ounce bar? Because I haven't got a 10 ounce package. I don't know. Email me about it, Nubs. You're trying to read my hat. This is a Zarek Farm hat. I'm wearing it because she just had a new. I'm wearing it because she just had a new baby goat um, born. So I'll show that again. I know some, some of you guys missed it, but here it is. There is a new baby goat. Very cool. You guys can check out her channel. Uh, Zarek, I don't know if you posted a video of it or not. I know you said a comment on it, but I'm not sure if you posted a video on it or not. Uh, doo -doo -doo. There's all the goats in there. That's what I'm talking about. All right, let's see. So we are going to do that. Yes. All right, so this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to... I'm going to do this. I'm going to add points to everybody that's currently active in the chat. I'm going to open the 50 like giveaway. Peggy Smiths, we are sold out for tonight. Uh, to do JW's a go. Ah, thanks, Element. You're lucky I know what that means. What's up, yo, Adrian? How's it going? You guys, there you go. So enter space one to get into that giveaway right there. Peggy Smiths, we are sold out tonight. We'll have to try next uh, next stream. All right, let's see. Nate Barber, where's the box at? Come on. Oh. 
There we go. All right, so I see everybody entering in there. What's up, DP? How's it going? Let me get this stuff set up. Get this thing in somewhat in the center. I get the camera over here. Oh, there we go. Mobile in every way we can get it mobile. There we go. All right. Let's see here. Uh, nubs, that package I did get. I just saw your message come up on my phone. That package I did get. All right. Chris, Southern Metal, are you the same as Southern Metal, or is that two separate people? Is that two different people? I was getting confused in uh, in Rob's in Rob's stream. TJ, no problem, man. All right, under the scope, that is just a little. Uh, I think it's pewter, actually. I don't think it's actual silver because the weight of it. Um, I think it's pewter. This is just a caterpillar keychain that I got um, from my uncle because he worked there for so long. It's just a dozer. I would re I really want to take this and try to sand cast it um, or cast it either way. I'm the son of Southern Metal. Oh, nice. But it's very, very cool. It's serialized on the back. There's only 5,000 of them made. These were given to employees um, of Caterpillar. So pretty, pretty cool. But there we go. I'll put it right there. That's just one of my things. Oh, uh, let's see. Uh, I don't, okay, let's see. Do, do, do. That is pretty sweet. Yeah, it is. All right, so we got three minutes left on that. Has the Hot Wheels font. Yeah, kind of. I, see, I can see that. I can not see that. Peter's Poor Man Silver. Right, right, yep. And then lead after that. I actually start. I actually thought about casting this um, in lead because I do have a lot of lead that I could melt too. I actually thought about casting it in lead because lead's like a lot smoother. Um, but we'll see because I don't want to waste the. I'm gonna get some delft clay for that one because it's got a lot of detail. I don't want to waste the uh, the delft clay. You have five minutes away from the cat factory. Nice popcorn king. That's awesome. When I was in Germany, we used to have to drive like four hours just to get to the, the nearest one in in Germany. But I love it. Love it. We used to have to go up there for parts all the time. Why do I have so much lead? Uh, one of the guys that at my work fishes a lot and he was leaving and he was getting rid of all his uh, he's getting rid of all his fishing gear, so he gave it to me. Do do do. Alright, let's see. What's up, Papa Giorgio? How's it going? I could do the lost wax method if I have lost wax, but I don't. I don't have all that stuff. So what I'm going to do is do the Delft clay, uh, put that in there, put it in there, and then uh, and then do it that way. Because the Delft clay, I'm going to buy it anyways. So I'm going to end up buying it anyways. But yeah. Let's see. All right, let's get on with. Let's get this ready for Nate Barber. We will grab his silver. Two Benjis right here. We have a 52 and a 52. Are they different mint marks? They're not. Okay. Let's see here. How about a 53 and a 52? There we go. All right. Let's see. And he's got 140. There's the Amazon. And let's see. There's the dimes. Do, do, do. Hey, Spaz, pause spare time. What's going on? I mean, we got two dimes. They are rosies. Let's put one back, try to get a Merc dime. I know I do have a lot of rosies. All right, let's try to get a Merc dime out of here. There we go. There we go. All right, right there. We have a 44 out of Denver. This is for Nate Barber, yes. Uh, doo -doo. I have a boxes of 50 cal lead balls. Friend retired from Thompson Center Arms. Nice metal dragon. That's awesome. Choices for 90s are Benji's Walkers or Kennedy's. 
What's up, CoinQuester? How's it going? Good to see you. Robert Shirley up in the house, too. Hey, Carper, how's it going? Muscle Shell in the house. Mike the Greek. Who else? Who else? Who else? Who am I missing? Come on. What did Josh say? Are you going to haul those legs up that muddy hill? 93 Chevy Chevrolet? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't. All right, here we go. Let's get on with Nate Barber's rolls. Oops, what happened? Here we go. Computers needs to catch up. All right, there we go. Hey, Juan Camacho, what's going on? Jenny Forrest in the house. Good to see you as well. All right, the giveaway is over. Let's pick a... You know what? Let's pick something to give away first. How about that? This one. All right. I think. Yep. Here it is. The last one that I have. Right here. The two-ounce copper round. Jonathan Cook, welcome to the little Benji Club. Thank you, brother. Right there. Let's see if it'll focus. I'll do here, and I'll go here. And here. And here. There we go. All right, there we go. So a 308 round, a two ounce 308 round right there. We would do that for the 50 Likeroos. Right there. So here we go. Let's find one. Five, four, three, two, one. Steel Wheels 99. Steel Wheels 99. Are you steering here? He just said, Good luck, folks. And you won. There you go. Congratulations. Mama Mill, how's it going? I just got a package uh, from Kittle today that he said it was from you. So thank you very much for that. I'll, I'll open it on Saturday. Very, very cool. Would brass shells that I find Melly Technic work in the forge? Yes, they will. Just clean them up as much as you can. That is a 308 Papa Giorgio. Very, very cool. Steel wheels. 99. All right, so Steel Wheels 99, what I need you to do is email me with your real name and your shipping address claiming this uh, giveaway prize. Just say, hey, I won the 50 likes. Thanks a lot. Here it is. You don't have to say thank you, but you can say whatever you want to. You want it, fair and square. So there it is for you. 50 likeroos. That is awesome. Yeah, Mama Mill. I was confused because Kittle sent me, or I got an email from uh, his when he did shipping saying, here's your uh, tracking number. And I was like, I didn't buy anything from Kittle. What did I buy? What did I buy? Uh, CoinQuester, I am sold out, brother. Only doing one box tonight. Hey, Gregory Ko Koaleski, how's it going? Uh, let's see. Do, do, do. All right, here we go. So, yes, yeah, Steel Wheels, please send me an email, and we are going to start on roll 22. I don't see Nate Barber in here yet to uh, say no to that. So here we go. So 10, 20, 1, and 2, and we have 10 rolls, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. There we go. Put them together. Put them together. Come on. Right there. Ten rolls. Let's do it. Let's do it. Do it, do it, do it, to it, to it, to it. I haven't heard from Big Mill yet today. Hmm. <laughs> All right, here we go. And if anybody is needing points and stuff, mods, you do have the add. You had the, uh, the add command at your disposal to use. What does it say? Hey, I'm new goats, awesome and tastier than any turnips any days. P.S. I live for live fire for your packages. Mr. Marmel, you're crazy. But please stay here. That is awesome. All right, here we go. Let's see what we can get for Nate Barber. And these are the 10 rolls that Nate got last time. He donated 10 for a giveaway to somebody in the chat, and then he donated 10 more for himself. So here we go. <laughs> Gringo, I don't know, man. Some of the, some of the, uh, especially with you putting the, the commands in there, I don't know. Some of them just seem to like you and not like you, so I have no clue what's going on with the, uh, the bot, but I don't know. 
Who knows? About time I was a mod. You see my watch hours here. Popcorn King. Oh, man. Popcorn King, if I made everybody a mod, then we would just, uh, we'd have pandemonium around here. We would have pandemonium around here. I like going into streams and like my first comment's gonna be like, please don't make me a mod. I know you like me. Please don't make me a mod. <laughs> What's up, Michael Badejo? How's it going? Let's see. I think I did that on, I think, Baseman stream. What was it? Base? I think it was Baseman stream. Um, was, I was just like, uh, I came in there and like my second comment was, please don't make me a mod. Right there, we got a silver dime right there to start off for Nate Barber. That's what I'm talking about. Come on. You're not allowed to make everyone a mod. <laughs> All right. Just straight stream anarchy. Yeah, so uh, when uh, I think it was Silver Nitrate first started streaming, um, he made everybody a mod. So it was like the stream would kind of mod itself, you know? And yeah, that didn't work out great. All right, let's see. So we have one right there in the middle. Right there in the middle. Let's see. 1969, 40%er right there. Come on, Nate Barber. Nate Barber's not even here. Come on. He's probably lurking. He's probably just waiting to see what he gets. And then he'll come in and be like, one, one message. Oh, thanks. Hey, thanks, bro. Ha, ha, ha. Sounds like more anarchy than no mods. Yes, exactly. And that's the thing is like, he was saying like, well, the stream will mod itself because everybody's a mod. So they just ask you to be responsible and just, you know, keep it PG. Um, but yeah, well, either way, some people, when they do auctions, some people, when they do auctions, and I actually think it's a good, it's a good idea is uh, that when they verify somebody's channel or verify that they know somebody, um, they will, uh, or have them register with the $1 PayPal or whatever, they will um, make them a mod so they know so they know uh, they can bid. Yeah, right there, Roy. So everyone has, has a wrench and silver nitrate stream so they can bid. Right, yep. So there we go. Uh, yeah, DP, I add all this stuff to these rolls because my bank is a pain in the rear and very very hard to get rolls so i've kept four boxes of rolls as long as i can uh and i just put stuff in there got a 2019 w san antonio quarter for change out of a vending machine today nice 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 shape yet for being a vending machine nice very where everyone has power no one has power right so i used to say that when um when i was in college and like people would uh like highlight stuff you know for notes and they would end up highlighting like entire pages. I'm like, if you highlight everything, nothing's important. I'm like, come on, man. SJ makes everyone a mod. Oh, nice. Everyone has a wrench. What's up, Rebel Stacker? Good to see you, man. That's why RT hassles J. Yeah. So the 74D DDO thing, I was getting bank wrap boxes for I think three weeks in a row. And then all of a sudden they were like, coin shortage we can't give you any like i'm like you know what okay got it well i'm glad i didn't turn these in before they told me that because i always go in there and i say uh and i say hey like i um just want to know if i'm going to be able to get coins before i turn all these coins in and they're like uh yeah you can but these are going to be your last boxes for a while i was like great right there we got a silver quarter come on I was like, great, cool. So now, and I asked them, I was like, can you please call me when I can get, when I can get rolls again? And of course they're not going to. So I'm gonna have to go in there. I went to a stream one night and I was the only one not a mod. Yeah, Josh, it's a weird feeling, huh? The 74 DDO thing, that was, that was hilarious because he was literally in here. And again, like he said, I can't remember who started it, but someone said, nope. Every time I checked one. So, and then there's like a little, like a thumbs down, uh, super chat emoji. And so he just started, boom, throwing that up there every time. Tend to highlight a lot when I'm studying. I think it helps me to retain it. Nice. Oh man. 
Uh, Rebel Stacker, so I'm actually going to be pouring silver tomorrow. I poured silver um, what, a couple weeks ago, or, or about a week ago. And so tomorrow, I'm going to be pouring some silver. So, video tomorrow. I promise you guys a uh, middle of the week, middle of the week um, poor video. So yeah. Hey, Carl Dunham Jr. How's it, Jun Jr. How's it going? All right. Let's see. So this is for Nate Barber. We have two Bendies right there. We have two forties, two dimes. Let's grab another dime and a quarter. Let's see. Hey, CM Silver. How's it going? Good to see you, brother. When can we buy a JW, JW Port? As soon as the video comes out, you guys can email me. And I'm going to address that in the video as well. Um, but I don't want anybody to pay anything until I get everything situated. Because I've had it with, uh, like, uh, Rob's had issues where people just, um, people just send money and expect a bar. And I'm like, oh, nope, can't do that. 43 out of San Francisco right there. There we go. Let's get rid of those and put this here. My experience, banks never call you back. Yes, exactly. So, and uh, yeah. But every time I walk in there, they're so rude. And I know everybody's like, just get a different bank, get a different bank. Well, you can't. I really can't. There's not many options around here. Um, have I sold any melting socks to RFT? Uh, so last time I checked, I only sold one pair of socks. But let me look on here and see um, if uh, if I do, or if I did. So I've sold two t-shirts, a hoodie, and a pair of socks so far. Um, and then I bought my own as well. So there is for Nate Barber. So thank you, good sir, when you do see this. Uh, let's see. And I know Gina R is chomping at the bit too, because she, every time I, uh, bring a bar on screen, she's like, I want it. How much? I want it. My bank says we don't get boxes. Yeah. Right. Uh, yeah. So I really want to just go in there and be like, Hey, what if, uh, you know, like, uh, like I think like what Rob was saying is that, um, can we just trade boxes, you know? Can we just trade boxes? You know, like I'm gonna give you a box of pennies and you give me a box of pennies. It's no, no number off of that, you know, but yeah, so just kinda stuck. But all right, there we go for Nate Barber. Next up is Desert Rat Stacker with five rolls. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five. Hey, Gina R, how's it going? Matt Stacker says, what's the damn deal? <laughs> All of a sudden, no banks have coins. Whatever. I have a business account. One of my banks can still get coins there at least. Yep. I know. Hey, fill up the board. How's it going? I've been able to swap rolls for rolls. Yeah, I, I don't know. I was thinking about uh, thinking about doing that. Let's see. We got two right there. Merc Dimes. Uh, 44 and a 41. Denver and a Philly right there to start off with. Desert Rat Stacker, let's go. Here we go. Yeah, I don't know what's up with the banks and all that stuff. I don't, I try not to, uh, I try not to cause issues when I go in there. And I really don't. I just go in there and I ask, like, hey, what's the coin situation today? Am I going to be able to get coins? And they say, no. Thanks. Thanks. All right, here we go. But I've tried like, uh, so there is a bank, uh, Wells Fargo Bank, within driving distance for me, which yeah, I think it's an hour and a half away. So if I had to, I could go down there. Uh, but even those guys, they won't tell me over the phone that I can get coins. So I have to go all the way down there just to uh, to find out if I can get them or not. And I don't want to get down there and then all of a sudden, oh no, you can't have can't have any coins. So I'm like, all right, well, sweet, thanks. Right there, we got a dime. Do -do -do. All right, here we go. I'll off and go to bed. All right, see you later, TJ. Have a good night, man. Gina said, you had me at bar. 
Oh, Gina, that's awesome. That is awesome. You had me at bar. I am going to send somebody one of those brass rounds, and I'm going to package it in that uh, 45 ACP box, the box that the rounds came in. Let's see. Here we go. One more. Found my first Ngawi Rust Quarter and Pocket Change. Very nice. I think that was like one of the first ones that uh, that I found because they were um, they're easy to find. Yeah, that was like one of the first ones that I found. No one here has the gummy worm. Folks were dry at Rob's stream too. What is the gummy worm? I don't know what you're talking about. I feel like there's something I'm missing. Do you have much? Oh, all right. Here we go. Last roll. So you can find another sticker. Come on. There we go. There we go. Come on, Desert Rat Stacker. Right there. Let's grab you these 240, the two dimes, and we have one more dime coming at you. Right here, that is a 63 from Denver. There it is. It's candy. <laughs> All right, here we go. Right there. And scoop. Perfect. Desert rat fart stacker. <laughs> I can't wait until I get my penny bag and serious need a wheat harvest. Yeah, I know, man. I can't wait until I get... Something a little bit normal. It's that's all I want. Something a little bit normal to where I can go in and not get looked at like, oh great, here he is. He's here again. Let's see. Send an email about a link with silver and gold team. Okay, I'll let you know what I think after this. Have you found any DDR or Wyoming quarters? I found two the other night. Uh, I don't. No, I have not. Not that I remember. I have a specimen beaver laying here. <laughs> nice beaver. Oh man. Tell me why I moved the big Primo water jug return station where there's a war nickel underneath it. Nice. There we go. 10,000 wheat cent bag break coming soon. Oh, Kittle. Kittle. No, that's all I'm going to say. That's all I'm going to say. I'm not going to email. I'm not going to. Nope. That's all I'm going to say. Kittle doesn't read my emails anymore, so I have to, like, I have to Facebook message him and then. Like sent him a whole bunch of different messages to try to get him to uh, to respond. All right, let's see. Yeah, nubs. Yep. See, send PayPal now. All right, Dick Lacrosse, are you in the house? Dick Lacrosse, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Oh man, let's get over here. All right, Dick Glick Ross, two walkers, two Benjis. Oh, you read the new tiers, that's good. You read the tiers update, that's awesome. Thank you for that. Two walkers, two Benjis, here we go. Get back to you about a week after the break. Oh no, gringo, it, it won't even be a week. Uh, it's a 42 San Francisco and a 42 San Francisco. Let's take the nicer one and let's get another one. 45 San Francisco. There we go. Oh, Gringo, I'll just plan on not being a part of it. It's fine. What albums won't ruin my coins? Element. Uh, I like using the Whitman Classic and the Dansko albums. Danskos are getting harder and harder. That's a 54S right there. There you go. Um, Danskos are getting harder and harder to find. But Dansko's and Whitman Classics, I like those. Um, they're the better quality albums, and they have the windows on the front and back. So I do have it on my Amazon, which I believe just passed a little bit ago. Or you can type exclamation mark Amazon uh, and get it in there. There's a 40. That's a 67. And let's get four dimes. Do, do, do. One, 
two, three, four. Let's find a couple mercury dimes. There's two right there on top. There we go. Try to mix it up a little bit. Uh, do, 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 do. All right, here we go. 52, 51, 43, and 41 right there. All right. Here we go. Dick Lacrosse. Big Mike, what's going on? That was a key date, Benji. That's what I just said, Apple user. That is awesome. There we go. That was. I mean, it's not a 55, but you know. Oh, let's see. Do, do, do. Besides metal pours and coin hunts, what are the hobbies in JW Coins and Hobbies? Uh, well, this uh, so a long time ago when I first started this channel, I was going to start doing uh, model building or Lego building, and I just haven't done it. It's a lot more prep and time than uh, coins is, but you know, you never know. I was going to order a dance code, didn't want to spend much money to ruin my good coins. There were a couple Whitmans. So yeah, but, but Dance Goes and Whitman Classic are really, really good. I just, I'm getting away from the folder type ones. Um, but yeah, key dates relative in veggies. Yes, exactly. Let's see, I've been buying Dance Goes about every time. Yep, exactly. Uh, but yeah, so I used to do um, Lego builds and I've had a couple recorded that I just didn't put on the channel because of the quality of them. I was like, eh, they're just not great, you know? Um, and the Lego build that I did, well, of course, that was back when I had like 100 subscribers too, so I had a lot less people watching the channel, uh, so I got a lot less views. Now, now, the way I know how to work like the SEO score and everything, I might be able to get it out a little bit further, but hoping with the birthday luck, some good stickers. Come on, Dick. Come on, Dick. What level are you turning today? What level are you turning today? Right there, we got a dime. There we go. There we go. I gotta pick up that coin. Here we go. There we go. What are you doing with that book? You took your buffaloes out. I look like a nice one. Uh, that one is already promised to somebody else, Josh. You don't really ruin coins more how I wear your storm and conditions. Yep. I ordered my godson the friend's Lego set. Nice. Or the office set. It's not Lego, some off brand. Yeah. Yeah, even the uh, even the off brand ones are pretty cool. I can't remember. They start with like a D or something. I can't remember the name of them. Duplo, I think. Duplo, maybe? Level 38. Very nice. Very nice. Use folders for modern how the Whitman Classic for older sets. Very cool. Yeah, I'm slowly uh, transferring all my albums over to uh, no matter what brand, whether they're Whitman Classics or the uh, Dance Goes, so I can see the front and the backs of the coins. If you don't already have it, you should get the Whitman 20th Century Coin Album. Which, so if it's not the 7070, well, I have two 7070s, um, but. If, if the coin doesn't already go into another album, then I'm probably not gonna buy the extra album. You know what I'm saying? Um, I may, I may end up if I come across a good deal or whatever, but uh, let's see. I'm new to coins, so I bought all my nieces and nephews quarter silver proof sets for birthdays, hoping to pick up the hobby. Nice, Metal Dragon, that's a great idea. And also, if you have anybody um, being, oh, right there, ho, ho, ho. Right there, I'm just talking and I look at the screen. Look at it. Would you just look at it? Right there, 1964, 90%. What's up, Native Warrior? How's it going? Right there. Holy cow. Talk about the birthday luck. That's what I'm talking about. But, anyways, we we're talking about the, uh, the, the young kids. Um, if you have anybody being born in your family and you they have like parents that parents that like coins or whatever, uh, like my my best friend, I got her a son, a uh, the birth it's like a birth announcement card. Like on the inside, it has all the coins on one side. On the other side, it has the birth announcement with all the stuff in it. You can put the picture, 
and write all the details and stuff. I thought it was really cool. So I got that one. Uh, do, do, do. Love the shiny. That's what I'm talking about. Toning's crazy on silver. I had 21P Morgan. I left in an Atmex flip. That thing started toning in three months. Yeah. I don't watch the pre-stream, so every silver is a surprise. <laughs> well, I don't I don't show all of them anymore, nubs. I don't show all of them. And I don't show where I put them either. Silver proof set in early 2000s are cheap right now for their melt value. Huh. It's very cool. Very cool. All right, let's see. Let's keep going. Right there, we got a quarter. We got a quarter. Come on. And one of everything except a 40 so far. Let's see. We got a few more rolls left. Dansko has one for just wheat cents. That's what I'm going to need because that's what I texted you about, Kittle, uh, was that I need the, the one with just the wheat cents because... Um, Where is it? Where is it? This one right here. So this is the one I just got. Lincoln Memorial since 1959, 2009, including proof only issues. So this one I just got and it's used, but it's like still brand new. Um, so I just got that one. So that's gonna be one of my next uh, album update videos. So that's why I need the wheat one. And reach out, okay. Apple user says 100 likes. Let's see. Good night, Danny. We'll see you later. Gringo says 100 likes. All right, we'll do it after uh, this box. Well, not the box, I guess. Let's just go ahead and roll it. We're going to reset clear. We're going to 100 likeos. And here we're going to give everybody in the points, points right now. And open giveaway. There we go. So exclamation enter space one. You can get in there for that giveaway. Dance goes are sweet. They are. They are. It's exclamation mark enter space one. Now we'll enter you into the giveaway. Let's see. Here we go. Look at it. Look at it all entering. That's awesome. A gazillion people entering right now. There we go. Oh, and right there, right there, we have a 1967 40%er right there. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, Gringo, I think I'm the only one that can do that one, uh, but I will add it again. There we go. For some reason, that's a owner only command, and I can't. I've tried doing it to where I can give it to somebody else, but I just can't do it. Silver! Ha, <laughs> Rickroll. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about, Party Pickle. All right, here we go. Hey, laughter, what's going on? Let's see. Let's see. And did anybody see Rebel Stacker with the $1 super chat? Thank you, brother. I do appreciate it. That is awesome. Is your emoji, what is that, Ren and Stimpy? I don't remember which one's which. I don't remember which one's which, but that is awesome. Thank you very much for that. Very cool. And I did change the boss, so the boss goes down a little bit quicker. So more people can be the boss. Uh, let's see... All right, here we go. Stimpy, there we go. Yeah, I don't know the, uh, I didn't know which one was which. Now, if you ask me which one Timon and Pumbaa was, I could tell you. <laughs> All right, come on. Michael E. finds up in the chat. What's going on, brother? Good to see you, man. He says, how's it going? How's it going? Oh, well, Michael E. Fines, what's going on? Just emailed you what album I have, the 20th Century Coin album. Nice, I'll have to look it up. 
Very cool. Ren is the dog. All right, so very cool. Yeah, I'm not uh, not very up to date on the. Uh, so maybe when I was a kid, I probably could have told you which one it was. But no, I I always I tend to forget things. I always tend to forget things that I don't uh, need to know. It's a log. A log. It's a log. It's big, heavy. It's wood. Huh. Powder toast man. Oh, let's see. All right. Next one. Come on. And we got a dime. We got a dime. And this one's funny because it's on that just torn up coin. That 2013 just thrashed. Thrashed on that one. Michael Lee finds chilling my dinner break here at work. I stop by and say hi. Well, thank you, Michael. That is awesome. I do appreciate it. I do appreciate it, brother. I hope you and Irma are doing well. You guys had a great, great box the other night. Uh, what did you guys end up finding for that whole stream? You know I don't, uh, you know I can't always hang for the whole stream. Usually after my stream, I end up either on a video game or I end up uh, out in the garage. Nubs hunts treasure with the sunglasses. Oh, he took it, boss. He took the boss with a dollar. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, man. No, sir, I don't like it. Don't like it at all. Oh, man. Here we go. Thank you, nubs. Let's see. Born free. Here we go. I can't remember who it was that got that, uh, not the 19, the... The 61 uh, today, the 61 today uh, on Rob's stream. I tried to turn it around and make it a 19 walker, but it just didn't happen. Coin Silver, call the police! <laughs> yeah, no, strategy. Yep, that's what I do too on Big Mill and on Rob's. That's what I do on that one too. I'll watch it and see what happens. And Nubs, you know the way. If you want to change a hat, you can. You know most of them that you can pick from. Now introducing the all-new international log. What are you guys talking about logs? I don't get it. I, don't, I feel like I'm missing something that I should be laughing at, but I just don't know what it is. Gringo says, yep, pick a hat. Pick a hat, Nubs. Let's see. Found 136 Wheaties and a couple foreigns in the cents, a buffalo and silver in the nickels. Nice. Oh man, that is really cool. I think it's OG 22 hard hat time. Where is it at? It might be out in the garage. I'll be right back. All right, here we go. There we go. We got the OG 22 hard hat. Uh, let's see. Jimmy the Clark. I'm telling you, man, I would have to look it up to know it. Seven 1939s. Were any of them uh, with a mint mark and key dates? I think that's the real reason. Oh, no. I'll tell you if I have to go. Overpaid for a 61 Benji just because I wanted it. Oh, man. Do, do, do. <laughs> Element. No, I'll uh, I'll definitely just uh, I'll just do this, and I'll have to and I'll have to say okay, I'll be back. <laughs> but I can hold it for a long time. No, Denver's dang. Do you have a fez? I don't know what a fez is, but I so if I don't know it, then I don't have it. Are you talking a Fez hat? Is that a thing? I don't know. I don't know what you're talking about. Is that that like square funny looking thing that Christopher Collects wears? If I sent you a hard hat for company, would you wear it? Ben Dowger, as long as it was clean or brand new, I would wear it. Uh, now here's a note to people who want to send hats, like baseball caps and stuff. I will not wear them if they are used as in like from a garage sale. I will not wear those. 
FX hat, Shriner hat. Oh, yeah, no, I don't have one of those. I don't have one of those. That's what Christopher Collects wears. But no, I don't, uh, I don't have one of those. All right, here we go. So let's do, let's finish up here real quick. Let's, uh, let's give him what he deserves. All right, here we go. So the 90s, the 40s. Let's see the dimes. We got four plus two and a quarter right there. So let's put all this up here on the screen. There we go. And let's make it focus. 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 There we go, kind of. I don't know. All right, here we go. Fez is a Shriners hat. I kind of figured that after I... Uh, do you have a who dat hat? No, I don't. I do not. <laughs> Forgot you vandalized a hard hat with those stickers. Oh, Carl's coins. Come on. Get on the boat, brother. Get on the boat. Come on. T love it where you at. Come on there. Oh, man. Would I wear a cyclone hat? Rebel Stacker, if you took over the boss and you told me to wear a cyclone hat, I would wear it. I'm not a big like sports like fanatic, you know? All right, here we go. Let's do this. Let's take care of this right here. And let's see, Dick Lacrosse. Let's see here. We're gonna pull out the stash. We pull out from the stash. I'm gonna find one. One that's not a 64 silver quarter. If I can. Maybe. Oh, there we go. Al H, thank you for subscribing. Let's see, right there, a 63 BU quarter right there. Hey, DMC, what's going on? Right there for Dick. We're going to put that one in there. Put these on the side. And let's find some dimes. I think I need a slushy. Oh, man. Always been a Hawkeyes fan of my Iowa days, but LSU number one. Well, so I grew up in Iowa. That's why I support the uh, Hawkeyes. Uh, because it's the Hawkeye State, it's not the Cyclone State. Um, but I would, I'm not like huge into sports. My niece goes to uh, Iowa. Hey, Ken Porter, thank you for subscribing as well. Do appreciate you. Smells stashy in here. <laughs> All right, there we go. So let's put this. We have a BU quarter. Let's see what else we got over here. See if I can add something cool. Do, do, do. Those are all 64s, but you know what? One of them's, they're both BU anyway, so you're going to get one of those for your birthday right there from my man, Dick Lacrosse. Dick, you've been a big supporter of the stream anywhere. Ha <laughs> ha, Carl's with the jokes tonight. That's what I'm talking about. Rammer, jammer, yellow hammer. Ha ha ha. Actually, my hammer to stamp all my, uh, all my pores is uh, black and gold too, so... I'm a big black and gold person anyways. My um, high school was black and gold. And uh, was any of my colleges? I've been to a few colleges. I don't think any of them were black and gold. But yeah. All right, let's see. There we go. Dick Lacrosse. Let's put all these in here. And then for the other two ones, I will put them in a separate envelope. Let's put these two in here, and we'll separate them. Yeah, I gotta keep them separated. Let's do this right there. Get in there. And we will take care of it here. Perfect. Boston Bruins are black and gold. Nice. Prospecting Coins, how's it going? Good to see ya. TNO up in the house. What's going on, brother? Good to see you, man. Deborah Waltz in here. Did I pick 100 like winner? I did not. I did not. Here we go. All right, here. So, five, four, three, two, one. Meek Rat. Meek Rat up in the house. Holy cow. You know what? What we're going to do for that is because I didn't pick anything anyways. We're going to go with a 64 and a 64 right there because I didn't pick anything. So, there it is. 100 Lycos. Meekrat, where are you at? Are you still here? And boom, hiding in the house. That's what I'm talking about. Right there. Meekrat. All right, we'll do this. 
There we go. There you go, Meekrat. Congratulations. Christopher Hart, did I miss everything already? Not yet. We still have, what is it, 15 rolls left. How do we have 16 rolls left? No, 10. We have 17 rolls left. How did that happen? I missed two. I missed two on dicks. Ha! Oops. You're famous, bro. You should get them to bring a Bebops down here. Rebel Stacker. If I could get a Bebops down here, they would send checkers gone. Checkers would be gone. All right, let's see. We got two more, and wouldn't it be for Tick Lacrosse for the last, his last one? Hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five. We only missed one. But the last roll had a 40 percenter in it. Right there. Right there. All right, Carpa, we'll see you later, brother. We'll see you later. Right there. Christopher Hart, different room? Nope. I actually used to sit right there facing, th or facing that direction so you would see everything this direction. So what I did, I did it so the wall is behind me, so everything's a little bit brighter, and all the artwork and stuff that everybody sends me can be shown on the wall. Right there. So there we go. You're going to add a 40 percenter to the package. And let's do this. See? You got to got to count mo better. You got to count mo better on those ones. All right, Dick. We'll add this to your package. Here we go. There we go. Now you've got all your stuff. When will the 40 millimeter? <laughs> oh, Philip, you never know, man. You never know. Uh, Goldman Jacks, anybody think that we're keeping uh, 2020 coins because of low mintage this year? No. Next year, maybe. Because if you remember, 2009 was a low mintage year because the market crash and everything happened in 2008 or the bailout or whatever you want to talk about whatever you want to say all that stuff happened in 2008 so that made the um mintage go down in 2009 so maybe next year it might uh next year is going to be a good year because of the new reverse of the ases um you know stuff like that so you never never know all right, let's see. So, Meek Rat sent me a, uh, a um, dear, an email for the 100 likes. We'll get it to you. I might just go ahead and do shipping tonight. I said that last week as well, but you never know. Let's see. There's the merch link right there. And if you guys haven't checked it out, uh, I know you guys have probably looked at the merch before. But if you haven't checked it out, there is a new hoodie. There is a new hoodie. And you know what? Maybe I'll just go ahead and add... Let me add this here. Where is it? Uh, merch. Properties. I'm going to add a picture. Uh, let's see. I'm going to do this real quick so you guys can see the new, the new hoodie. All right. Now let's see. It'll, it'll run through and then it'll show. And Penny's going away April 20th. Oh, come on, Carl. Come on, Carl. Meek Rat. Yes, please send me a strongly worded email. Yeah, the Make Me Melt one. It is a, uh, it is a good one. I, I like it anyways. I had a lot, of good, uh, a, good, a lot of good reviews on it. Oh, I should have made that one into a coffee mug. I just noticed when that one, that coffee mug came up. Scored an 18, 12, large cent, 8, uh, 2 over 1, cap bus and auction. I have 3 starting. It looks like between a 30 and 40 grade. Nice. Very nice. Uh, let's see. I talked into joining the reverse ASE thing today when ordered the CT one. Uh, yeah. Oh, let's see. Your vintage figures will be huge. The U.S. Mint maximum production levels right now. I believe closures or not. Yep. We'll see. Uh, yeah. But maybe next, maybe next year. I don't know. So never know. All right. Let's see. Nubs. Nubs hunts treasure. Have a good night, Zarek. We will see you later. Waiting for my three coffee cups to show up. Yeah, I'm still waiting on two. I ordered three, but I'm waiting on two. I got one already. I got Rob's. I'm waiting on mine, and I'm waiting on Rob's other one. 
All right, so that's a 67. Let's try to find another year. 67, 67, 67, 67. Seriously? Pull out the stash. Come on. 66. Right on top. There we are. There it is. There's those. And let's get two dimes. Yeah, element 67, 67, 67, 66, 69. All right, let's see. Lafta says in the UK they're gonna have a lot of NIFC denominations this year. Are you guys uh, are you guys on uh, not lockdown? Of course you're probably on lockdown, but um, lower mintage this year too. Like are they stopping slowing down production? So do they be busy tomorrow night? Tomorrow night I will be melting, or tomorrow I will be melting at some point, but I don't know. Nubs 61 and 54. Denver and a Denver. Let's take the 54. That's older. Find you a Merc Dime. First Merc Dime I see. Oops. There's one. Perfect. I like to throw stuff around. There we go. All right, Nubs. Five rolls. I'm melting. All right. One, two, Three, four, got an auction, and you're the pro. Oh, you need my help with an auction, huh, nubs? Need my help with an auction, huh, nubs? Send me a message in Discord, man. Remind me. Remind me about an hour and a half before the auction. I haven't seen any 2020 coin circulation yet, apart from Brexit, 50 pence. Oh, okay. So I do like that Brexit one, though. The old man be heading to sleep. All right, Roy, we'll see you later. You're in a seven-hour webinar today. Holy cow. What's up, Archaeology Mikey? How's it going? Have a good night. Uh, do -do. Alfred R. I thought pop in after reading Discord messages. I was buttering you up. I believe that maximum amount for heist is 100,000. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Come on, nubs. Let's see. And we got a dime right there. But yeah, Nubs just remind me, brother, right before that. But I still work. They sent me, oh man. Buenos noches. Do, do, do. All right, see you later, Michael E. Fines. Have a good night at work, brother. See ya. See you later, Jan. Have a good one. All right, come on. Oop, where'd he go? Here we go. We need to talk uh, Sheldon into having a live stream so he can start saying like his Team 87 and we can go in there and start saying Team 86, baby! When Sheldon starts saying Team 87. Right there, nubs. Team 86. Team 86, it's going with you. I don't care. I know it's only worth 50 cents. You know what? Maybe I'll go counter stamp it. Nubs, did you ever show that 2018 that I sent you? Honey in the box and first auctions. Okay, so like I did, uh, like I did last stream, doing the boxes first and then doing the auctions. Sounds good. Team 47, baby. <laughs> oh, I had anxiety for Black Bart all night at that auction. You win some, you lose some. I know, Josh. Yeah, that was a good auction though. I had, I had a lot of fun. I, that's probably the most fun I've ever had doing an auction. Um, just because of some of the comments that came out of you guys. That thing were hilarious. Boom, Team 86. All right, here we go. Let's do this. I need to click some clicks. There we go. I need an 84 Counter-Struck. Philip Dixon. PD84 counter Struck. Denver or Philly? Denver or Philly? You let me know. I could probably do a proof, but then I'd have to charge you for it. <laughs> Two ounce Merc Dime was awesome. Uh, that Merc Round? Yes, it was. It was. Byron says, come on, Team 84. Team 98, eh? Is that Alfred R? 
Alfred, I thought you were only 13. Here we go. We got the two 40s, the two dimes, another dime, and we're going to throw that 86 in there. Let's not forget Team 69, says yo, Adrian. <laughs> there we go. Oh, look at that. Another Merc dime. Uh, 45 out of Philly right there for that one. Cool, cool, cool. Let's get her for nubs. Philip Dixon says both. All right. There we go. Boom. Right there. All right. I'm not going to staple that one because I'm going to go counter stamp that 86. 68 or 69 proof set turned into a hot item. Yeah, one of those, one of those definitely, uh, definitely was an argument that was going on in the, uh, yeah, you're only 13 in Penny Dog Stream. Yeah, those proof sets, one of them was a, uh, a battle for sure. All right, let's go. Byron, my friend from over the pond, let's do it, do it, do it, to it, to it, to it. Byron, what do you want for your 90s? Let's see. Boom, boom, boom. See, now I got to hit him forward. I can't hit him backwards anymore. Walkers, he says. All right. Do, 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 do. Rob just responded to the text. He's, do you guys remember in Rob's stream, he was talking about me, him, and Big Mill always talking all day long? And right at that moment, I sent him a text on his phone that just said, buzz, just to make his phone go off. <laughs> and he just responded. He responded, he responded earlier and says, question mark, come on. <laughs> oh, that is great. All right, here we go. So we got two walkers right there. Get you two dimes. Uh, do, 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 do. And two merch right there. We have a 23 and a 37. Two good dates right there. All right, here we go, Byron. Let's go 10 right here. And Byron, please. Well, I don't know. Is your address in PayPal good to go? Uh, I'm not sure. I guess I can make it work. Uh, if, and if not, I'll message you about it. But if you want to, you could send me a Discord message or an email with your address. Dumb it down however much you need to to make sure it gets to you. Buzz message followed by a honeybee emoji works. Ooh, there you go. Found 1998 wide, wide AM a couple weeks ago. It was one of my videos. Nice, coin quester. Do, 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 do. All right, here we go. Come on. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Baby shark, do, 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 do. Come on, Philip Dixon. Now you probably got that in like 85% of the people's heads in here. I like the uh, the metal version of it. The metal version of that's a good one. We got a quarter right there. I could probably sing it, but I don't want to blow you guys' eardrums. Baby shark. <laughs> yeah, Gringo says no, stop that. All right, Gringo, what other song you want to get stuck in your head tonight? I'll get some songs in your head for sure. Bo, 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 show, show, show. And then you can come watch my gaming stream later tonight. Yep, Nubs is singing it. There we go. Can't beat a shiny proof set with silver. There you go. Let's see. Here we go. Do, do form of torture. I would walk 100 miles. <laughs> Farming. Uh, so I don't know if I'm going to farm or if I'm going to play my new game, Nubs. Um, I might farm. I might farm. But I played that new game last night, and I don't know. Were you watching? Were you watching last night? I was getting frustrated. Frustrated. Move to the impact on my team. All right, Byron. Let me know. 
<laughs> uh, so Gringo used to be a DJ, so he knows all of these. Uh, he knows all of these songs. Um, too sexy for my shirt. <laughs> we got a dime right there for you, Byron. Not Farmville. Farming Simulator 19. You hauling logs up a mountainside? Yeah, right. That was ridiculous. You gonna play the new game? Everybody wants to play the new game? You get an upgrade from the pickup truck you're using? I have not. I haven't. Oh, wait. I did get the, um, what's it called? I think it's called a scout in the game. It's a, it's a, um, the cha-cha slide. Oh, Jesus. Um, it's a, like a Land Rover. I did get that, and that's the one I completed that final, or that, that main task with to get all the way up the mountain right there. We got a quarter, we got a quarter. Oh, it's on a 2009 too. Nice. Let's put the quarters with the other quarter. Here we go. Here we go again. One hop this time. <laughs> See you later, Richard Sappington. Have a good one. Scout 800, there we go. Oh, and Byron last night kept saying like, hey bro, put it in four wheel drive. Oops. And then another one. I was trying to go and I couldn't figure it out. And he's like, hey, take out the parking brake. Ah, oh, dang it. You need to have a foot, a recommended truck. Well, I don't have the, uh, I was thinking about getting uh, American Truck Simulator 2 to play that one as well. Because that one really does look like a fun game. Uh, that one, you kind of have to follow the rules on it, but you never know. I mean, maybe you don't. Maybe you could turn off damage and all that stuff, but. I know you could turn off like tickets. Oh, there we go. Last roll of the box. Last roll of the box. Right there, Byron. Right there, brother. 1967 for Byron. There we go, we'll put that there. Let's look at the rest. Let's look at the rest. There we go. That is it. Grab these two walkers, these two dimes. We got two quarters here, another dime, and a Bodie, Bodie, Bodie. Euro Truck Simulator is on for like three dollars. Ooh, I might have to do the Euro Truck one just to uh, just to um, get used to it. Hard hat time. Wearing it. Look up, Baby Shark for kids. Oh, Metal Dragon doesn't know what Baby Shark is. Oh, don't don't YouTube it. Don't do it. Don't do it, brother. Well, I mean, you could, I guess. But, you know, we'll see. All right, Dick, have a good night, brother. Thank you again for tonight. We will see you. All right, let's grab two quarters. Two quarters. Let's see a 64 and I'm not doing another 64. Come on. Find something besides a 64. Whole entire roll of 64s. What about this one? Ooh, there we go. I see a 50s. 59 right there. There it is. Another dime. I wish I had my SS tumbler that's in storage. I could tumble some brass and the boys would send it out. It'd be interesting. If it's less work, if it's clean. Well, so here's the thing, Henry, is I didn't want to get in a discussion in the, the, the comments because I knew I could talk to you here. But for me to get a tumbler, tumble all the brass, and then melt it, you're just adding more work tumbling it. You know what I'm saying? So you're just adding more work tumbling it. And that's why I am not going to uh, tumble the brass when all I have to do is melt it and then cut out a little bit of the slag. Now, what I did order was a deprimer because I had a lot of people yell at me for, oh, you didn't take the primers out. Well, okay, got it, cool. Um, but I didn't take the primers out, so now I ordered a deep primer uh, to take all the uh, primers out of the rounds so we can do that, but either way. All right, let's see. Byron. The collector, right there, boom. My daughter hates Baby Shark. She used to text it to her when she was in high school. You are a great dad. You are a great dad. That's awesome. That's all I needed for reloading. No, taking the primers out when you're melting it. I had people yelling at me left and right because I didn't take the primers out. Don't forget the 40s for the tears. 
Oh, one. Yep, you got a 40 for that one. Duh. There it is. Holy cow. Come on now. There it is. Sorry about that, Byron. Thank you. Thank you. There we go. Right there. Alrighty. What do we want to do for an end of stream? You know what? No, nope, can't do one of those. Let's see. Since we're talking about this stuff, I'll be right back. We're going to grab it. Get, uh, end of stream. All right, here we go. Would it help if the pour torch on the molds when you're pouring? Uh, if the molds aren't hot, then yes. Uh, do, do, do. I don't get why everyone's so worried about primers. Yeah, because they're nickel plated, that's why. That's why. People are just worried about it. Element, stop it. You don't have any flips in your Amazon listings. Uh, I thought I did. Should, let me check. Do, do, do. Nothing wrong with leaving the primer, so as long as you know the cases were fired. Yes. Do, 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 do. Tink, tink, tink. We'll stop at element. All right, let's see. So let's go to the let's go to the list of coin roll hunting. Have any art hills around? Ant hills around? Uh, Henry, uh, actually, somebody in town was talking to me about those, and they they do them, and uh, yeah. Let's see. I'm looking at the flips right now. All right, maybe it's a different link. So let's do this. Let's copy this link. This right here. Uh, let's see. Paste. This is the link for the um, coin roll hunting link right there. Uh, did you? It disconnected you from the chat. Oh man. Range time with JW. Uh, I won't show the range time. I won't be doing that. But. Here we go. Let's see. Which one? Yeah. In the spirit. In the spirit. Of. Uh, brass and ammo. And just because it's 2020 and the world's going crazy. Can we focus? Please focus. Right there. We're going to do one of the brass hammered uh, bars that I did. Send brass! <laughs> right there. Some of those brass anthill casting videos are giant flesh eating buggers. Oh, man. So, one of them, uh, somebody gave me the idea tonight in Rob's stra Rob stream uh, to do the watermelon cast. To do the watermelon cast. So, I think I'm going to do that one. I watched a couple of videos on it and it was pretty cool. All right, let's see. Clear. We are going to do the EOS. That would go great with the JW aluminum bar. It would. It would. Uh, EOS. We're going to do the EOS. We are going to do a three-minute timer on it. So, if you're not in, if you're not, if you haven't talked in chat for a little bit, start saying something. That way, I can give you points because it only gives people points that are active in the chat uh, so there it is and we are going to add that and we are going to open the giveaway so now you can enter space one there we go and you can enter so if you're act there we go I'm going to add some oh stop it there we go add some more points lots of brass but not in bars there we go deep fried ice cream there we go do I have brass melting videos I'd like to learn? Uh, Metal Dragon, on my channel are all my melting videos. I may only start live streaming half dollar hunts once a week. I don't know. It all depends on what silver I can get. 
Um, we will see how that goes. Send sauce, says Muscle Shell. Rebel Stagger says redeem brass bars. There we go. So we don't know. Um, I do not, I'm not gonna do a live stream pour uh, just because um, you just never know. If something goes wrong, I don't want it live. You know what I'm saying? So I do not want it live. Do I think anything's gonna go wrong? No, but I just don't want it live. Copper coated lead, your favorite traded commodity. Hmm. <laughs> uh, so I actually have a few rounds that are the hollow point rounds that are actually exploded. There's exploded out that I was trying to take one and put it on the brass and it melted all lead out. So that one it got really stained. New line with a twenty three ninety nine says that brass though. Oh come on, new line. <laughs> Thank you, brother. And I think, yep, you just took over the bot. That is awesome. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That is very cool. And Metal Dragon, I don't have a lot of melting videos yet, but I do have them. I only put, I put them out on Mondays. Tomorrow is gonna be a silver melt video, so I'll do it on uh, Thursday. We'll do that, so. It's just a kind of a one-off deal, though, of doing them on Thursday. Oh, that is great. Is it better to sell strip copper as scrap and cast, or cast into bars? I mean, I don't, I buy stripped copper, so it's up to you, Juan. Do you want to make money on it or do you want to cast it as bars and keep it? So that's up, that's totally up to you. Gringo, yeah, new line says pick a hat. Pick a hat if you want to. Ren and Stimpy Bar would be cool. Yeah, then I'd have to buy the stamp and then having that stamp made would be like $190. So doesn't want evidence for his command to see. Oh, come on, Philip. Oh man, all right, let's check out this giveaway. We got 23 seconds left. Let's see, let me finish some of this water. Yeah, Rebel Sacker, those stamps are expensive. Oh, Metal Dragon, yep. Beaver hat. Mama Mill, beaver hat, here we go. Oh, right there. Oh, let's see. 250 for 1,000 rounds. Oh, let's see. Do, 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 do. My teenage son pissed me off once, so I changed his ringtone to sing out Carl's dad is the greatest dad in the world and called him a middle of... Nice. That is awesome. Don't you mean stimp? Where do you get stamps? I get them online. There's actually three people that I kind of I kind of go back and forth um, with the stamps, but I got mine on steelstamps.com. And they, uh, so I design them so they don't charge me extra to design them. Um, but yeah, can you melt the lead out of spent rounds? Uh, yeah, you could, you could, it'd be like one at a time, or you could just, uh, somehow put them all into one. So they're all facing down and then it would be hot. And then they would just, the melt would just drip out and some Davy Crockett hats. Yeah. Right. 30 pounds of strip copper. Yep. I bought, no, nah, I won't tell you guys. I bought a couple things and I went to, when I went to a scrapyard the other day and I got a, pretty much a handful of strip copper for free. So that was nice. But, all right, night laughter. All right, here we go. So let's draw this giveaway winner. Oh, we gotta figure out what we're doing. Oh, the bar, there we go. Come on now. Five, four, three to one. Carl Dun Durham Jr. Right there, Carl. Can you use sand for a mold? Yes, yep. Sand casting is definitely one good way to do it. But look up how to do it because it's it's not just sand. Uh, it's sand and clay mixed together and the clay comes from kitty litter. If you wanna make your own green sand or you could just buy uh, the stuff. But So I'm gonna be doing a lot of different videos on how to do stuff, so. You spent melt rounds of copper will float on the lead. Nice. Congrats, other Carl. <laughs> All right, Carl. So I need you to send me an email, brother. Please send me an email. You can do exclamation mark email in the chat and it will bring up my email. Uh, send me an email to claim that. Uh, I have your name, obviously. Um, so just, uh, and you can use plaster as well. You can actually use fire rock, which is fireproof um, sheetrock for houses has to be the fireproof but yes or sand castling <laughs> oh man watch four nines finds videos yep i will 
let's see. All right, so let's write down four nines fines. There we go. All right, Carl, there we go. So let me put this in a package right there. What to do E O S and Carl Durham Jr. There we go. Staple. All right, perfect. What's up, S Blank? Uh, I've installed that stuff before. Yep. All right. Asa says, All right, I have arrived. Fret no more. All right, so there is the JW Undiscovered link here in about five maybe 10 minutes, I'm gonna be live streaming on that channel. So if you wanna go over there and hang out and watch, um, and I mean, it's really just watching me play video games. So if you wanna hang out, watch there, or just chat, that's where I will be. Uh, thank you guys for the donators tonight, and thank you for everybody hanging out and chat as well. Do you have any coin molds? Uh, not yet, I don't, Jack. Not yet, I don't. I'm buying, buying more molds about every week, just to make stuff that people want. Big Mill with the five dollars super chat says, "Always late, but worth the wait." Who's the captain of this ship? Come on, Big Mill. Oh man, thanks, Big Mill. That's what I'm talking about. All right, holy cow. All right, you guys have a great night. Thank you for being here. Uh, yeah, I will be uh, live streaming on the other channel. So if you missed that link, you can scroll up or there we go, right there and. Uh, See if it'll come up. Did I shut the bot down? I already shut the bot down. All right, just go look up JW Undiscovered, and uh, and we will be good. JW, who should I get a coin ring from? Rebel Stacker, go on to Discord. Go on to the Discord and get a hold of Ringin Constitutional, and I will put the Discord uh, link in here if you're not already in there. I already turned the bot off, so I can't do the command. Plumbing issues, said Big Mill. Oh man. All right, buenas noches. All right, let's see here. Connecting, the computer's a little slow right now. Big mail, we just got done, brother. Just got done. All right, let's see, come on, Discord. There it is. All right, so let's go here, and I will put this, as soon as it clicks. Philip Dixon donate. I'm the captain of the ship, he says. The Marines sent in a $5 super chat. Thank you, Philip. I appreciate it. I appreciate you. And here is the Discord link right there. Asa, it's a $10 super chat. Says kind of early, but anyways, girly. This is off. This is going off the rails. I need a redo. <laughs> Oh man. All right, Asa, thank you very much for that. Big Mill, worst mod ever. All right, guys, we'll see you around. Uh, I'm going to go to that other channel and start streaming on there. So we will see you guys there. And uh, yeah, see you here in a few minutes. If I don't see you there, then I'll see you on probably Rob's stream on Friday, Big Mill stream on Friday, Big Mill stream on Saturday, and then my stream on Sunday. Uh, Nubs, and then you can put in when you're streaming tomorrow. Nubs is streaming tomorrow, so go check out his channel for the comment video. And we will see you then. Peace.